find out. Like what? Yes. Like, what did you want this body hair section? For sure. <laughs> Bad things, fine as hell, thick as fuck, oh my god, that's my baby, Caroline. That's right, y'all heard glow. It's 7 p.m. on Friday, well, I mean, it's 7 p.m. on Saturday. Well, no, actually, it's a lie. More like 8 p.m. on a Saturday. Man, tomato, tomato, it's 7 p.m. somewhere. We going out, okay. That's my better judgment. I decided to go ahead and film a get ready with me. I have less than two hours now to be outside the door, okay? I'm trying to give section baddie, okay? She's hot, she's cute. She looks a little intimidating, but that's not because she is intimidating. It's just because she has social anxiety and she looks that good. You know what I'm saying? That's the vibe I'm trying to give. You can't touch me. Like, I'm too hot to be here, but I'm not. I'm a sweetheart, you know? That's the vibe I'm going for. Good thing the wig that we're working with today is from Ali Pearl Hair Company. It's one of those wigs that's pre-done, pre-plucked, pre-bleached. Like this wig, I, once I bought this wig out the box, I was like, okay, I feel confident that I can get ready on time. Like this wig is already pre-plucked, it's pre-bleached. Like look at that. I, I feel like Ali Pearl is one of the companies I actually generally feel confident saying like, oh, like this hair is actually good quality because consistently they give really good quality and apparently they like recently upgraded their knots on their wig so like it's even better pre-plugged better bleach it's so tiny like knots wear like you can't even see these knots they're literally so freaking tiny actually now i'm looking at it they're actually i can barely even you can't even tell 13 by 6 frontal hd lace this is exactly the wig that i need to be a section baddie because section baddies be having them a nice little bust down and today we're going for a bust down 30 inch deep wave wig 250 density like she is long she is laid this is what you need in the club literally my, i was telling my friend i'm gonna film before getting ready she's like you're not gonna get ready i've never seen you finish your hair in an hour oh that's a lie in fact i even have because i'm gonna do my makeup at nine and it's 8.22 right now, I'm gonna show you guys how good I am and how easy it's gonna to be to install this wig. We're gonna prove her wrong, okay? First thing we gotta do is give it a good little lace tint. No matter how HD that lace is, I need it to be the exact shade of my forehead. And this one I'm using the e.l.f. concealer in the shade Cinnamon. Since we're on time crunch, I'm just gonna focus it mainly on the front part instead of dragging it all the way down. It's really the front part of the lace. Make sure I get it on the edges nicely well. I believe this is a large cap size, so it's gonna be really nice and roomy. If I'm wrong, I will put that on the screen, but I think I asked for a large cap. Make sure I got my clips and combs secure because the last thing you need in the club is our wig sliding and falling off. Especially with this wig being like a bigger size. If your lace is like, if you ever really like see like your lace is like puckering up, it's probably because you're not tightening the wig in the back. If you have like a really big lace like this, you wanna make sure you're tightening it nicely in the back for it to fit your head perfectly and not like pucker up. Okay, see that? Right the box. Plucked to perfection. I'm gonna honestly, I think I'm gonna just keep it in the middle part. Like it's even already pressed down for you. It's gonna be such an easy install. I feel it, I feel it. I'm gonna go ahead and cut off all the excess lace because the lace is quite big and it goes over my ear. Dang, this lace is big. And <laughs> And then to cut off the lace, I'm gonna use my uh, favorite razor ever. These razors, I love it so much because it's just like so sharp. I'm gonna be careful. It's a little bit too sharp. And this lace is so thin, jeez. It's cutting off that butt. And then to lay down the lace, I'm gonna be using my Kiss Color Spray. And today I'm using the seven hold. Look, he's gonna go into the club, I should be using the 10 times hold, but I only have the seven times hold. Seven times hold holds really good. I've never tested it out for going out, so we shall see how well this stuff holds up tonight. I'm just gonna put that in underneath, make sure I get everywhere, even the like piece in the back, you know, on the sides. Make sure you spring it everywhere, because that part be needing some spray too. Now we press. Bro, the lace on this is so thin, it's like literally melts so easily. 
And then for this part, I gotta spray on top because I can't spray underneath. Make sure I don't miss any spots with the spray. I want everyone to get laid. Don't embarrass me in the club and have my legs lifting. Let's see y'all, they even changed up their hairline a bit. It's not giving super like out the box. Y'all know I love to customize my hairline to look more realistic. This hairline is looking really good, not gonna lie to you. Not even gonna hold you. See, it's 8.34, almost halfway there, so let me not get too cocky now before things start to go left. Now let's go ahead and just create, clean up the hairline a little bit. I'm not gonna do baby hairs, I'm gonna use some mousse to like do little swoops. I just swoop the edges, the front part. That just gives like a really nice, clean look versus doing edges. So I'm just gonna do that. And just, you know. I like doing this too, it's a lot faster than having to do like create actual baby hairs. So, swoop right here. satin band to help hold everybody down and in place. I'm gonna cut these sideburns to be just a little bit shorter. I want them like super long right here. Okay, that's for the installation part. That took us what? That took us 12 minutes to do, period A. Now we can get into like getting the curls together. All right, so I have a spray bottle. It just has water in it. Water and some conditioner, which is like what used to be in here. So I'm just gonna, why it's not spraying? So I'm gonna trench the hair down. I want the curls to be juicy and popping, okay? I have saturate the hair with um, water, and then for the other half, I like to use mousse. This is like, I get like a big old concentrated bottle. This is a lot cheaper. It's Nairobi mousse. The wrapping foam, it's, a, it's half water in here, half mousse. I prefer to use mousse versus just water in my hair because the mousse just dries a lot faster, honestly. And I'm just gonna pop that into the hair. I'm not gonna take it too high up because high up, it's already been like nicely pressed on top for me and I don't want the hair to like get fuzzy on top. So I'm just gonna run the loose throughout the hair to get every piece of product nicely well saturated. scrunch the bottom too to get it to scrunch up
get those curls to like clump up and stuff. All right, cool. That's this side. Now let's go ahead and do the same thing on ooh, the other side. Nine more minutes before it turns nine o'clock. I mean, ten, nine o'clock, yeah. We're right on schedule. instead I was getting hot in that robe while this hair on my head but okay okay let's get into this makeup real quick I feel like I've also become the master at doing a quick makeup look the part that's gonna take me the most is gonna be my lashes for my lashes I have not worn lashes like strip lashes in forever I've just been obsessed with doing like lash extensions and I know how to do them fast so I only do like half lash extensions I can't really talk too much through most of the parts, so I'm probably gonna do either typing the words on the screen, voiceover, whatever, because I also wanna play some music. So if you guys would allow me that, you know? Okay. Now I'm going to put lip gloss on last, but I'm going to get dressed now. But honestly, I feel like doing my brows last was like what helped a lot because my brows take forever. So doing them last kind of like made it go faster. But okay, let's get dressed. Okay. I just need to do the finishing touches. Where's the oil? My body oil. I have the spray. Should I do shimmer first and body oil? No. Yeah. Oh, damn, never mind. I already sprayed the oil. 
spoil it. In the part, because it's a little bit off centered. Just a bit off centered. And we did it, y'all. We got ready. We're ready. Period. Part. The hair is very simple, but it's doing just exactly what it needs to do. Okay. It looks good in the back. It's quite long on me. But it was so easy to install, as y'all saw, when we did it so fast. And the lace, the hairline, it's eating, it's giving. Like, what? Makeup? Eats and we did that super fast too. It's really the lip. I feel like the lip matches like the small coloring on the dress. The dress is from Fashion Nova. Like what? Excuse me. Excuse me, honey. Ain't nobody in my lane. Like we look good. Sections given a section baddie for sure. Like don't mess with me. But okay, I gotta get going now. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Hope you enjoyed getting ready with me because I sure did. It was fun. I'll see y'all in another one. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And peace out, Girl Scouts. Goodbye.